good Wednesday morning. Uh, futures trading up again this morning. Uh, no surprise, every uh, night we take them down and European open comes and we uh, take them up. So uh, 902 up to 915, we're trading right there around 915. Pivot's 908. Bullish bent again, uh, down to probably about 906. You want to be long today, otherwise uh, uh, we'll see where we go. We'll see if we can break out of this range yesterday. We couldn't get over that 9 pre-market, that high yesterday of about 916. If we can get over that, we might be off to uh, test the highs of 930. So that's about it. Uh, it is, um, again, you get Geithner speaking today. you got Intervention Nation going on. A lot of chatter, a lot of talk, talk, talk. Not a lot of action, just a lot of talk and intervention and meddling. So uh, we're coming into this holiday season as slow as possible and uh, they're probably going to grind it right to a halt. I don't see uh, too much going on either way. There's really no economic news uh, all week. There hasn't been. So we're in this news vortex and uh, I expect this just to continue to drift up, down, random you know, random movement and uh, we'll, see where we, we'll see where we finish at the end of the week. But uh, in my mind, I'm kind of uh, checked out for uh, the holiday. Uh, it's on already, and uh, the volume is getting thin, and I would not um, place any big bets in a market like this where anything can move it up or down. There's, it's, it's really a directionless uh, market uh, for the last few weeks, uh, and it probably will be next week also since we have a short four days. People will trickle back slowly, and we won't get back to uh, some real trading until June. So uh, that's it. We're going to mark them up next week with the uh, month-end markup. And uh, I, I continue to uh, uh, believe as long as we stay over 870, which uh, we did test, 875, we'll continue probably higher. So 870 is the line in the sand. If we go into that, we go to 800. Otherwise, look for 950,000 to be hit sometime here uh, in the near future.